Building a car at the GM Lordstown plant is a process that from start to finish takes about 20 hours. I recently spent a morning at the plant looking at what it takes to build a Chevy Cruze. A steel coil being lifted from the floor marks the start of a Chevrolet Cruze. This is the west plant of the Lordstown complex, also called the stamping or body shop. The coil is lifted by crane and placed on a press into which the sheets of steel are fed. The stamping process creates the body parts, pieces like the doors and hoods. All of the parts are welded together by robots. When the bodies are finished, they're moved by conveyor to the paint shop. Each body is first run through a liquid, which improves the finish and durability of the paint. The sealant and paint are 100% applied by robots. Each of these three arms is applying sealer on different parts of the car at the same time. The paint's applied the same way, all with robots. From the paint shop, the car is dropped into the trim shop. Now this is where the bulk of the new investment here at the GM Lordstown plant came from. This is the new trim shop at the plant. Total investment just in this area alone, $50 million. Primarily the trim uh, shop focuses on assembling the glass to the vehicle, building up the doors, and doing the interior assembly. Here a front seat panel is being installed, and later on it's the console between the front seats. It's also in the trim shop where the crews and Chevy logos are added. The cars rise up and down as they move along the line and ergonomic design to make it easier on the workers. The seats, they're installed by robots. Grab one, slide it in, put it in place, and out. The windshields, the same way. Secure a piece of glass, swing the arm around, and oh so gently drop it into place. There are 266 total operations in the trim shop, after which the car heads to chassis. Where the chassis of the vehicle, the engine, transmission, tires, and some of the uh, exterior components are put on the vehicle. Near the start of chassis is where you'll find the motor line, a sort of subdivision of the assembly process. It is here where, among other things, the engine and transmission are married. I am putting the bolts on the center of the motor adding my uh, transmission, uh, lining it with the motor together. You have your motor mounts, transmission mounts, radiator hoses all get put on along this line. It is along the chassis line where the engine is put into the car, all of which is then secured. This is the front cradle secure, and it secures the uh, motor and the uh, um, AGV together here with two bolts, four bolts actually. This is the final line. The car is pretty much finished at this point. As you look down the line, it is eventually started up and driven off. Over a thousand cars go through here every day. From the first coil through body and paint, passing through the trim shop and chassis, all the way to the final line. Total time to make a Chevrolet Cruze, 20 hours.